Uh, well, hello everyone. The start screen looks uh, kind of ominous. Living machines against the indomitable human spirit. Uh, what kind of scenario is this? It makes me think Terminators, but uh, I'm not sure. Honestly. So, um, we'll just head into this. I have no idea what to expect. Uh. Oh boy. I expected human resistance. It's... Oh boy. Alternate targets. What the hell is this footage from? Oh, this is historically footage. Jets! Tanks. NATO? Okay. I do like saying this up, huh? I'm wondering if I should turn down this music. I'm just gonna do this real quick. Only because of the possibility of... Oh! That's not a good start out. Evasive maneuvers! Oh! Go. <laughs> Why did he get out? Are they rescuing people? Is that what's going on? Also, where is this music playing in the background? That is a good question. Uh, please do not have a fight with the jet. Uh, oh, that's a... Is that a hovercraft? What was that? I know. That's not the right word. There's some sort of drone to- ah! Howdy! The robots want to kill us. Again, for contact from the last one, an AI known as Sentient Web had started its extermination of the human race in Eastern Europe uh, on the premise of world peace, ironically. NATO and the Soviet wow. Union managing to stem- I mean, that is the one thing, well, everyone, including every human, fears, that if we give a super intelligence the idea of grant us world peace, they will just eliminate humans because humans kind of crave conflict. Not all humans, but uh, a lot of them. So, yeah. Also, is this from a certain series? Um, I've never heard of it, if it is. It's flow only for an invasive tunneling system to cause it to re-emerge in the Balkans, oh. and more specifically, Greece. So now the Greek military is left to fend off an incursion as a coalition fleet moves through the Mediterranean. Oh. With the first to arrive uh. being the British Airborne, including the SAS, so be prepared for terrible ah, the SSA, English accents, the SAS. and I apologize. Also, you know one thing that murderous extermination robots don't have? What? Body hair. Which is one of the worst transitions to a sponsor I've ever done. What? And I've only ever done like three. It can get so much worse from here. That being said, today's sponsor of Humanity's Defiance is Manscaped, a surprisingly fun not a bad to sponsor work with and a leader in male hygiene. Which, by the way, look at these analytics. I know mm. you have balls. You can't hide from me. Anyway, <laughs> Manscaped is of course a brand you that now has a staggering me. nine million customers worldwide, and they want to talk about their performance package, which includes a bunch of stuff such as their new Lawnmower 5.0 Ultra, which is the best name for an electric razor I have ever heard in my life. The Razor mm. also has an interchangeable skin safe blade head to protect me from myself and includes a ceramic oh, and oil blade nice. to give you more options. In general, it's just an overall improvement from I could use a good blade like utility. that. This thing also has its own LED lights built in with multiple color tones just in case you wake up in some godforsaken cellar and you want to look uh. at it. Where am I? It's also rechargeable. Where was he? And his water I actually do want to know. On top of what essentially getting two razors in one, this package comes with a whole bunch of other stuff, but I thought it'd be funny if I made Tails read it, so I wrote a small script for him. This kit uh. also comes with the Weed Wacker 2.0, an electric waterproof nose and ear hair trimmer. Additionally, there's also the Crop Student Crop Preserver, the ultimate aftershave and cologne. If I ever get to do, like, sponsorships, I do want to have my friends read them in just the craziest ways. Like, I want to do the crazy ads that you see sometimes. One day, you're driving, and suddenly, this bolter appears in front of you and smashes through your door. And I don't know where I was going with that, honestly. I would just try to make something silly and fun, because if you're going to do a sponsorship, why not have fun with it, you know? Your balls, which gives the perfect shaving experience, which mm. I... Tales from Mignus, I'm so glad to read on this script. To add <laughs> to all that, this I am so glad to read this. Bonus items such as the Boxers 2.0, the principle of men's comfort wear. Additionally, it comes Ooh. with the Shed 2.0, the 
The perfect place to keep all these wonderful products. I am back to nice. finish this off. Uh, head over to manscaped.com to get the new performance package 5.0 Ultra today. With my code Rubik's, you'll get an entire 20% off, plus free shipping, plus the bonus items. That's 20% off. No, I doubt everything. any sponsor Use the code would sponsor or tails me. will find you. All right, oh. thanks for putting up. Well then. I don't think my, I would ever get a sponsor mostly to the idea of no one really watches some of my more original content. With uh, my gaming review literally having nine views. I'm not upset about it. I was a little bit surprised at how many I got, actually. Because that was me trying something different. But at least some people like some of my gameplay stuff. Very, very few of you. But it's still nice to know. Not with me. I can't thank you enough for some of your time. And I hope you enjoy uh, watching us get killed by calculators with legs. Calculators with legs is the... Calculators with legs is the best description I've heard about uh, robots trying to kill you. Um, what else was I going to say to that? Oh, yeah. I was trying to say that, no, I'm not mad. I know I just made it sound like I was mad, but I'm actually not. I just like knowing what you guys like us to react to. And the only way to do that is usually through analytics. Or me just trying new things and basically throwing this, Ah! Do you guys like this? No? Okay. But yeah. I just want to say one thing. Uh, we've reached over... 1k and 500 subscribers and I just wanted to thank you all before we continue the video. You are all truly wonderful and I hope I'm able to keep doing this stuff for you guys. So yeah. What? Ah! Never met Wait, them before. I what did he say? Yeah, go for it. What? Oh, no, that's friendly fire. Oh. Put, Dead. Put that down. I feel like this is not ergonomic for pilots to have. It is. What do you mean? No, you. Shot me, pilots, from what I know, are usually given just like a pistol because there isn't much room in the cockpit. Jinx is dying right now. Yes, he is. He's been shot. Oh. I. <laughs> Why are you a Mocha has the aircraft? A pumpkin luchador. What do you say? What do you say? Wait, 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 wait. Why is he a pumpkin Mocha luchador? A jack o' lantern luchador? What? What is what? Oh my God! What'd you say? <laughs> Into the camera. Caught in 4K. What? What? Sausage Roll 2, is that really their designation? No. Don't jump. There he goes. There's always one. <laughs> Take him down. Take him down. What is... Oh, then I was about to say something, but then he immediately died. Hey, the town behind us just exploded. You guys sent here to rescue us? No. Stop reversing! Hey, there's a helicopter coming down. Oh my god, they're on Oh! Well, funny enough, that type of helicopter was called the Flying Coffin, so, um. It's living up to its name. Not in a good way, though. He's out here. Okay, thank you, Bede. My name is. Oh. What is with all these? That's not his normal accent. I was pulling back a bit. Holy shit! Oh. I mean, isn't that pretty normal for Ignis? To be completely honest, they get. <laughs> They usually get bombers destroyed inbound. by knowing going. Oh! Leaving. Oh! oh. Be They're gonna do attack run! <laughs> Danger close! <laughs> oh no! Oh, uh, run. run! Why did you drive? Oh, oh my god! Oh, holy Why shit. did you drive down the road like that? Did Why not just that? drive off the Is road? That our car back there? Uh, I would be scared okay. to do anything road right road now road in this. Uh, the far southwest objective. We can oh. try. We just lost our transportation over at the other one. Oh, okay. Oh, what the hell? 
They just... The fact that two planes went down right there is insane. I don't know anymore. They're bombs. Noxie lost all their clothes. Oh. <laughs> bombs. Oh! <laughs> Maybe, uh, do something about the bombers? Oh. oh. And it looks like they don't have mid. It looks, looks like it. I don't think. Do you have AA guns or something? <laughs> Silence. That was a kill. Look at her um, fucking whip. Look at. <laughs> uh, right. uh. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Is that a bomber? Oh! You could just hear the screeching noise of the bombs coming in. He's <laughs> oh, yeah. Why is he naked? Oh, oh down. <laughs> no! Oh no. It's coming oh. towards us. I think that's an AA tank. Is that a crossbow? Yeah, it sounds like a Vulcan uh, candle. Damn! Why do you have a crossbow against robots? I am God's bravest biplane. Oh my god. Why? <laughs> I am making fun of you. I love that. Is it possible to cut cargo rope? No! Oh shit! Oh pfft! Just land on them. Just land the tank on them. Did no one give him a war? Uh, yeah. Hold on, hold on. Everyone out. Yeah, get out. Get out now. What is the biplane even doing? I. I guess I know what the biplane is doing now. It's dying. <laughs> what was he going to even do with that? Was he just going to ram into him? Because I'm pretty sure that thing didn't have any guns. This is in World War II. You can't... Well, actually, biplanes weren't used in World War II. No, they were only really used in World War I. But, uh, but besides what I just said there... Can I get a... We lost the biplane! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Why don't your soldiers have clothes on, Snail? Uh. <laughs> what? <Whoa. laughs> oh, the There's a parachute from the bike. <laughs> <plane. laughs> they are just getting ramshackled by ballers. Oh. Wow, you actually did. <laughs> Tell her. I want to go back to that bit for a second. Oh. Yeah, what does that mean? Well, I don't think they have any air support to help you with. They just seem to have helicopters. You ran right into my machine gun, my child. Tails, where are you? Wait a second. Oh, God. I don't think this is safe. Is that Kirby? Oh. Oh, that looks disturbing. Safe? Is that Kirby? Of course it's not safe. Oh, oh, fuck. Wait a second. Oh, where did they get this? No, that is a... Oh, that's creepy. You are not gonna... Oh! I didn't know this thing had a hover mode. What the hell? What's happening? Is Arma just really mad at them today? Oh, pfft, now they're all dead. Do I have a little seizure going on? That's the steam from the steam turbine. Are we being oh, targeted there's... by a missile, Mr. Pilot? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> they're popping so many flares. Anymore. That's an A-10. Yeah, hold, 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 hold. Oh, an A-10? Who in the fuck? 
They just have an A10 in the air. That's not a, one of ours. A monster on top of that hill. Um, uh, oh. Two chain guns. oh! Yeah, You're two chain guns hurts. Shot of your life. That might be a near vertical adjustment. <laughs> yeah. Uh, lodge. I don't think the law will work. Right, no idea where that went. Oh, Wonderful. There he is. Oh, okay. That's Stelio. Oh, oh. <laughs> Stelios. Oh. Oh my god. Go, go, go. My huge eyes. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that was them breaking the sound barrier with the bombs. Yeah, that's an A10. Warthog. Why? Who is it? Did you get your shirt? Who is it? Is that Mocha? God damn it! Mocha? Wait, are you not certified? <laughs> okay, <laughs> God damn. Loka knows how to fly him. He somehow keeps surviving, but I don't know how, but he's a damn good pilot. Oh! Oh! Okay. I'll have you go on my Oh, wonderful. That's what you get. Wait, I'm not out of this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't use... Never mind. Car, AT up. <laughs> Finally, you're useful. I have one. You don't take come here. Good work, guys. You got these AI fucking scum on the run. I did well, Claire. Good. Damn. Took down another vehicle. Good. I'm gonna ignore that. You probably should, honestly. What? There's what a so what? Torpedoes what? Torpedoes a so is that it launched a torpedo? We just dropped a warhead. What the hell? <laughs> what? The what the hell is going on? Why is there a submarine in the air? <laughs> Did the robot somehow make a flying submarine? What, what the hell? <laughs> it's, it's leaving. It's heading out. What the, the hell? Is here. Is here. Oh, no. oh, no. <laughs> the submarine's fly- Oh! <laughs> I would run away as soon as I saw it, to be completely honest. But goddamn. Minimal casualties, eh? <laughs> I'm not too sure about those minimal casualties. I'll be completely honest. Anything else? No. But yeah, that was a fun little adventure for them. A little operation for him. But dear god. The bombers just kept doing bombing runs on them. It was like, wow. They were never going to stop. Ever. I didn't know what to expect there. But if you like us reacting to stuff, please tell me down below what we should react to next. I'll try to put it, mate. I'll try to put it down in the list. And like, comment, subscribe if you want more. That tells me that you want more. More than pretty much anything else. And I'll see you later. Why am I talking like this this time? I got no idea. I honestly have no idea. That hurt my throat a while. But bye bye.